All right, so about an hour ago, Global got a new data download. So in this video, as always, we're gonna quickly go over exactly what it was for. Now, real quick, before we jump into it, a big shout out to my boy Proton and 10MG on Twitter for posting all the assets. If you guys aren't already following him, then definitely go ahead and do so. And with that said, let me just quickly pause the music because we're gonna watch the promo movie for the upcoming LR uh, Trunks and Vegeta. So here we go. I will get stronger. Stronger than the enemy, and stronger than you! I'm putting all of our hope into this one blast! Don't underestimate Moses, and especially not the Saiyan! Take this! Now it's gone! Okay, so obviously I've seen their animations before, but it's been a while and I forgot how nice they looked those are actually some really really clean animations so yeah uh trunks and vegeta are finally coming um arguably i mean at least a top five unit in the game right now uh i think most people would rank them higher than five but the point is they're really really good and uh after that we have the assets for the lr this is the ssr art there's the TUR and also the LR Trunks and Vegeta. We have the side unit, which is a uh, Goku Black. And uh, I guess this is the SSR and that's the TUR. Is that actually the TUR? Yo, I forgot what he looked like, but it doesn't look that great. I feel like the SSR art is like significantly better than the TUR. I gotta say, like, this looks like an SSR art for, like, a free-to-play Goku Black, honestly, but it is what it is. Not a big deal. Uh, next up, we have the uh, Awakening and Extreme Z Awakening for the uh, Super Strike event, King Vegeta. And, of course, we have the new stages for his event, uh, 3 and 4 for his, you know, Awakening medals, as well as his Extreme Z Awakening medals. Speaking of which, these are his Extreme Z Awakening medals. And uh, also, the new Dokkan event for the Trunks and Vegeta, the Dokkan Awakening Medal, and a new Boss Rush Stage, Stage uh, 16, and a new Infinite Dragon Ball History Stage, which is Stage 21, versus Sworn Enemies from the Future. And uh, from there, we have a few uh, new tickets. This is the Tons of Thanks tickets for the, um, uh, basically... I said thank you celebration banner in the previous video, but obviously we already passed the thank you celebration. So this is just for, I guess, the winter celebration. And uh, you can use these tickets to summon on a future banner, which will include the LR Trunks of Vegeta, as well as the 7th anniversary LRs. And then, of course, a Dokkan Festival ticket for the, um, you know, Trunks and Vegeta banner. So... Uh, two tickets right there as far as the release date for all this stuff. It's gonna be uh, November 28th, which is in about two and a half days from now at 6 30 a.m. GMT Well, actually, I guess it's gonna be three days from now Because we just turned You know, it just became the 25th. So um, Yeah, I guess three days from now November 28th once again at 6 30 a.m. GMT, which I believe is 1.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think I got it right this time. And uh, that applies to everything, you know, the LRs, the events, and all that stuff that we just went through um, previously. So, yep, yeah, 28th, 1.30 a.m. Eastern Time. And uh, finally, we have some updates to the login screen assets, which... Um, you know, it's cool, I guess. It doesn't really affect us right now. I mean, I guess it means we're gonna get a new login screen, which is cool, but this was like an old login screen, so I don't know why these were updated, but either way, we're getting a new login screen um, for the Trunks and Vegeta, I believe, which is gonna be cool. And uh, we also have a new scripted event asset, which is a Topo. So there you go, we got a Topo. We got some new assets for the login screen. And of course, 
the uh, other stuff we already went through. So that is basically the data download, guys. Um, nothing that we didn't really expect. Essentially, just uh, the stuff that we saw in the news. And uh, the last thing I wanted to do before we got out of here is pop over to the Dokkan Wiki and go through the details for this King Vegeta because I don't think I'll be covering him anywhere else. So if you guys want to know what he does, then feel free to keep watching for a few more minutes. His leader skill with the Extreme Z Awakening is uh, Int and Fist types keep plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 70%. Super attack raises defense for one turn, causes supreme damage, and lowers attack. And then passive is key plus 4, attack and defense plus 70%, plus an additional attack and defense plus 10% per pure Saiyans category ally on the team. And high chance of stunning the attacked enemy when all allies on the team are pure Saiyans characters. Plus an additional defense plus 50% and medium chance of performing a critical hit with another Vegeta's family, category ally, attacking on the same turn. Pure Saiyans and Vegeta's family, uh, category allies, attack and defense, plus 25%. So, uh, overall, a pretty solid, you know, Super Strike unit. Um, you know, he's gonna do some damage, get some defense. Um, I do like the high chance to stun if you have a Pure Saiyans team. And also a medium chance to crit with a Vegeta's family, category ally, attacking on the same turn, which is, you know, not hard to satisfy. And then uh, the support is nice as well. So, um, I mean, on paper he doesn't look like he's gonna be crazy, but he looks like he's gonna be he's gonna be a fine substitution or like a filler unit for your Vegeta's family team or your Pure Saints team or one of the other teams he's in. Speaking of which, uh, Links, Rail Lineage, Saiyan Warrior Race, Saiyan Pride, Bombardment, Blazing Battle, Super Strike, and Shattering the Limit. And categories are Pure Saints, Vegeta's family. Terrifying Conquerors, Inhuman Deeds, Space Traveling Warriors, and Storied Figures. So that is the Super Strike, Extremes the Awakened, King Vegeta. And that is going to do it for today's video, guys. Once again, a big shout out to my boy, Proton at 10MG on Twitter for posting the assets. Once again, follow him if you haven't done so already. And uh, expect some summoning videos for your boy, or from your boy, for the uh, Trunks and Vegeta banner. I think this one, I might go... A little bit deeper than normal. I'm feeling like maybe uh, a thousand stones. We'll see. We'll see. I don't want to commit to anything, but I do really want these guys. So if the first initial summoning video doesn't work out, I'll probably come back for a couple more until I get them. So uh, that's it. That's all I, I, all I got to say. That is the data download. Thank you guys once again so much for watching. And as always, if you liked the video then make sure to like the damn video sub to the channel if you're new hit that notification bell so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and until next time have an awesome awesome day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out <laughs>